Hi everyone, uh, please listen to this clip. Now, if you're planning, if you're planning on scamming a foreigner, you better think twice because what's going to happen is that Rafi, he's going to go to Rafi Tulfo. He's not going to just run away and give up. He's going to go to Rafi Tulfo and Rafi Tulfo is going to put you on television and you will be publicly shamed and everybody will know that you are a scammer and a thief and so you better start thinking twice about that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> that was funny. Uh, uh, just listening to Terence uh, about the uh, s uh, scammers, that was very funny. Um, you know, it just kind of remind me uh, of, uh, you know, of the you know I saw it on the news that uh, a man called the cops because uh, he uh, he was sold with a fake uh, pot. <laughs> Oh uh, boy, he was he's he's trying to smoke pot and then he he got he got scammed by uh you know the dealer <laughs> and he called the police so he got arrested. <laughs> oh boy, so he ended up in jail. Oh boy, that was funny. <laughs> All right, so uh, anyway, um, so Terence was sharing us with the, about the. Uh, uh, actually, he's he's warning, uh, you know, Filipina scammer, you guys are gonna be uh, gotta be careful now, because uh, you know, if you scam the foreigners, they can go to Rapid Tulpo, they can uh, they can report it to Rapid Tulpo, and you will be dragged, you know, uh, you will be dragged to uh, be in front of the TV, uh, and then a million of people will see your face, you know, so. You better think twice before you do something uh, stupid, you know. All right. So uh, for people who doesn't know uh, Idol, you know, we call Idol Rapi Tulfo. I love his show. I watch uh, a lot of episodes. And yeah, I've seen that uh, he helped uh, a lot of foreigners, you know, against uh, Filipina scammers. Uh, so what, what do you do when, uh, when, you, uh, when you got scammed by a Filipina? And I, you know... I certainly hope not, but uh, you know these things can happen. Uh, it's better, though. You know, my suggestion is uh, when you were trying to, uh, especially when you're on those dating sites, uh, you should, uh, you know, just with everything else, just be careful. You know, uh, not to uh, shell out too much money or showing that uh, you have so much money. Uh, try, try to impress your Filipina. You don't need to do that. You know, if your if your Filipina is uh, is a good Filipina, you know, uh, she she will be very uh, you know um, she would not be asking you to, with with uh, so many things with a lot of things. You know, and then uh, let, let me just uh, tell you a story. I watch it this on, on uh, actually on on Paul Cha Paul Paul channel. It's about the Filipino scammer, and, and I think he he interviewed that uh, that lady twice, something twice, because I, I see it twice, and then you know she used to be a uh, online dating scammer because uh, she uh, she, have, she was young, she was like in maybe 23, 24, and then she had like three or four kids, uh, each kid with different uh, boyfriend. I think she was uh, like a burger, you know. She tried to try to do uh, anything just to uh, just to to uh, to fit, you know, uh, her kid. But uh, I'm sure you know she started with one and then dating the the second boyfriend and then got pregnant. <laughs> now it's two mouth and then you know dated another person and got pregnant. You know she's she's just could not find the right right uh, right guy you know so it, it it can happen so i think i believe she ended up with four kids and you know she and then she was and then uh, i think she find out a way to uh to get money instead of going uh, or, uh going dancing in a, in a in a bar uh by scamming people online and you know she she would ask uh, her story uh, uh let's say to uh Foreigner number one, you know, asking for certain things, and then uh, tell foreigner number two, you know, that that she need another thing. So you know, that's what she's been doing, uh, and then she was getting away for you know. Um, um, you can watch that, uh, you know, just uh, go to Paul channel and then Google the uh, Filipina scammer, 
anyway, uh, but then uh, finally uh, she found a a good a uh, good man, and then so finally she was able to settle down and also um, equip herself with uh, with skill, and she was also now a uh, like a, what do you call that uh, entre- entrepreneur. She already started her own business. I could not remember what kind of business, and and no. So she is now like you know, uh, paying it back by uh, you know sharing uh, the secret of what she was doing in scamming the foreigners. So kind of very interesting. That's why I said I like Paul. Uh, I like Paul uh, interview. Uh, there there are other stuff that I you know I just ignore. Uh, if it's not my uh, my thing, I just you know I don't watch it. But this is the th- thing that I really enjoy, you know, uh, learning, uh, learning from him, learning uh, about life, you know. So, so same thing with uh, Mart. Uh, every man has a story. Okay, so now you got you got, you've been scammed by your Filipina, and then if you go onto the dating dating site, so I, you know, like I was saying, just be careful. And then, uh, if you get scammed, you know, make sure you have all the uh, all the receipt that you you sending to your Filipina, and uh, all the record of your email uh, of the chat uh, text message and save it, because you 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 never know you might you, you might uh, need it uh, one day, and then uh, if that day c- uh, come, you know, so you try to contact Rapid Tulfo. Uh, you might try to call or email the staff will tell you can you just come over here at the uh, TV station and then you go there and you go there you just wait in line and then until one of the staff will kind of do an initial interview with you um, and then to see if they will they can take your case if they cannot take your case they may probably refer you to a government uh, you know entity that uh, you can go report that uh, that uh, scammer so and then if you are the lucky one they're gonna you know see you so you go there probably you wait in in a waiting room and then they might also like uh, maybe idol rapi will come out and say hello and, and kind of kind of try to get to know you a little bit and maybe explain a little bit what's going on uh, how the process will be uh, i never been to <laughs> I never been to Rabbit uh, Tubal uh, Studio, but I read it. I read it. I seen picture, and I also been on TV, so that's why I know that you know, like the behind the scene, what's going on. And then once uh, you're in, and you know, you're gonna tell your story. They're gonna interview you, and then you, as we have seen on TV, you know, uh, Rabbit Tubal always have uh, like two assistants. And they will be listening to your story, and then you will tell what happened. And uh, after after listening to you, they will contact you, try to contact your uh, Filipina girlfriend, and she better answer it because if she doesn't answer it, sometimes uh, if the, the case is very serious, sometimes you know they will call the sheriff or the chief of police, and they will take action and go to her place and bring bring the, the Filipina over to the TV station or tell the Filipina you better show up or you're gonna be arrested or something like that so it's serious uh, and you know Rafi Tufo they have a, they have a team of lawyers just sitting waiting to file charges <laughs> and you know they also have uh, other investigator uh, and then uh, you know of course if they contact your Filipina your Filipina will, will tell her side of story, you know, again, there is always three sides to a story. The foreigner side, the Filipina side, and the truth, right? The third is the truth. So, uh, you know, after listening to your uh, the Filipina side, and if they're not convinced that, uh, you know, that uh, of her explanation, they will take action. They will take action. They will say, hey, you know what? Uh, you, you have, uh, you... You are fault. You try to scam uh, the foreigner. You need to pay it back. Can you pay it back? If sometimes they could not, you know, and then you know they would try to arrange kind of uh, uh, um, kind of arrangement that uh, that will be um, that will be uh, uh, you will be uh, you know 
give you like a you know option like uh, would you accept this uh, you know uh, arrangement or or certain uh, maybe uh, amount if that's okay with you and if you agree beautiful everything's everybody's happy you know but if you don't then they will proceed they might say hey, we can proceed this uh, proceed the case you know we can file charges and they will uh, sometimes you know sometimes you know probably say hey but i i gotta go back to you know uh, whatever yeah i gotta back to us because i only own here uh, on such a period you know it's okay you you go back but they will continue the, uh, the case for you so that's what i was reading or uh, at this i heard so uh, so if you there good news you got uh, idol rafi watching your back if you have a problem uh, you run into problem with the Filipina, you can always give them a call, you know? All right, so, and, and if you're Filipina, you do not want to, you know, be uh, be dragged, you know, because uh, they're going to put you on TV with millions of viewers watching you, you know, they're going to find out you are as a no-good scammer, right? Okay. <laughs> so anyway, I hope, uh, you know, um, I hope... Uh, I explain it well you know uh, if you have any question you know always feel free to comment below and I'll try to answer you and then uh, um, you know let me know your thought on this video um, have you heard of rapid tool for if you are a foreigner I would like to hear from you if you have heard of rapid tool for all right thank you guys thank you for watching take care and stay safe and God bless bye bye now